-hmm. I've had teams, I had a couple teams in, in Orlando here where, you know, we ranked well in set plays and then we weren't as good when it was the end of offense, when we were just playing ball. And then the last year we were here, we tried to fix that. And before injuries, we were actually on our way, but our set play wasn't as good. And our end of offense was a lot better. So I think a lot of it for us, it was the, it was the reads. One of the guys, he did a great job with it is his name is Pat Delaney. He's uh, he's the lead efficient now assistant now with Wes Unseld in Washington. And he did a series of three on O, and that was the way we warmed up almost every day. And we would take versus switching versus the drop, uh, any defensive coverage, you know, basically took NBA coverages, be it pick and roll, dribble, handoff, screening action off the ball, post-ups, whatever it was. And we worked on the reads, the counters. And I, the other thing I liked is, I, I don't know if you guys agree with this, but I've always found starting practice to be one of the hardest things to do where you want to set a tone where they're getting loose and there's injury prevention. And the thing I liked about this is, you know, we use the the video guys as token defenders and they were only going about three quarters speed. But so there was a level of concentration and intensity they had to have to make the right reads. And I felt like it got them into practice uh, a lot better, you know, 